Hi guys, Steph here. <clears throat> so, I'm going to try and do this video super fast because I'm in like a Christmas gift wrapping frenzy. I was planning on doing it a bunch last night and Miss Ava woke up coughing and was up all night. The bags under my eyes are so big I could go on vacation with them. Yeah, but I have to stay up late and wrap, 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 wrap. And that's like... <sighs> not even a teeny little itty bitty dent in it. It's so bad. Anyway, I finished this card. Yeah, I'm going, you're going to be seeing Christmas cards all year round for me because I am, I am going to be using Chris, making at least three Christmas cards a month. I'm telling myself that. That way I have them for next year. So here is the card I finished today. And what I used was for my main image, I used Greeting Farms Vivi. She's super cute. And I Copic colored her face and hair. And the elf, her hat and her dress and her shoes are all paper pieced. And for that, I used My Mind's Eye Vintage Christmas. Right there. And it was kind of a pain doing, you know, I did two different chevrons and, you know, doing green and then red and then teeny little pieces, but I like how it looked. I wanted her to look kind of like shabby, you know? Um, so, oh, and I Copic colored her present and I used some, a glitter pen on her, the bow on her gift and then I used stickles on her very lightly. I just wanted a little bit of shimmer to her. Oh, and this part here I used um, the liquid applique that puffs up. And then for the papers back here and here I used Echo Park's Winter Wishes. Love this paper. It's super cute paper. And then for this blue paper, which I don't know if you'll be able to see on here, but it's shimmery. And that is from Die Cuts with a View Shimmer Cardstock. And it's just really pretty shimmery cardstock. And I had gotten that at Marshall's a long time ago for $1.49. And so I used that to mat this. And this was actually a Spellbinders die. Then I masked her and used my Lawn Fawns Let It Snow and I used the hill and I used the tree and the medium tree and I also used the snow cluster here and for the hill I used Brilliance Pearlescent Sky Blue for the trees, I used Memento Cottage Ivy, and then for the lighter ones, I just stamped it off and did a shadow effect. For the snow, I used, where is it? Sorry guys, um, it's a color box, and I don't know where I put it, or it's a cat's eye, one of those, um, I, I can't find it now, but I used that for the snow. And then for this here, these I cut out in the shimmer paper as well, and they're paper tray ink uh, snowflake dies. And then I used one of my October afternoon Make It Merry Brads for the center of it, and just glued that on there. And I used some Brilliance Moonlight White on the edges very lightly. And then I used a strip of American Crafts glitter tape in peacock blue. And then here I cut a strip again of the shimmer paper blocking my light. And then I used this Martha Stewart punch that I had gotten in a rack from Steph10892 and it's super duper cute and I really wanted to be able to use that and just layered it over the blue shimmer paper so that it has uh, stands out a little more and there you can see the shimmer on that and then I used two Studio Calico 
tree veneers. And I'm not doing good showing you this lighting. There we go. For this one here, I used... Oh, my finger's going in the stickles. Hold on. <laughs> I'm a hot mess. For the green one, I used green stickles. And then um, for this one, I covered it in Cottage Ivy ink. And then used red and gold uh, perfect pearls or liquid pearls. God, I can't talk either. Then I also used three of the snowflake wood veneers from Studio Calico. I color covered those in the Brilliance Moonlight White ink. And then for the bottom two, I used Stardust stickles. And for the top big one, I used Icicle stickles. So that is the front of my card. And I think it turned out cute. And on the inside, <clears throat> I used the same papers. Um, just carried them in and used my scraps. And for the season's greetings, and, oh, I'm sorry. I totally forgot. The Let It Snow here is from the Let It Snow Lawn Fawn, and that's stamped in the Memento Danube Blue. And then on the inside, the season's greetings is from Paper Smooch's Christmas Sampler, right here, season's greetings, and that's also in the Danube blue. And then this star up here is from October Afternoon's Holiday Style Flower Sack, which is those. And... That's it. I kept the inside really simple this time because I was in a rush. So that is my card. I hope you guys like it. Um, uh, let me know if it'll annoy you guys to see more Christmas cards throughout the year. And also, um, I will be making more winter cards. They're not going to necessarily be Christmas. They'll be winter themed, you know, for a thank you card or a birthday card. I'll use my winter ones because I have a ton that I need to use. So that's it for now, guys. I gotta go wrap, wrap, wrap. I hope everyone's having a great Christmas Eve Eve, although by the time this uploads, it'll be Christmas Eve. So, all right, guys, thanks for watching. Bye.